Hello traders, this is Forex Nelson. I'm back doing another live trade. This one is on the pound CAD, as you can see down at the bottom here. I originally got in right about at this price. According to my, as this blue candle is going up, according to my pip trigger rules, along with the meter, after I analyzed the charts, I figured that the pound CAD was the best one to do um, at this point in time. Now I know the London closes here and if it does not break the top here uh, then I'll just close the trade. Actually I want it to break the top and keep going up some more but it may not do that. The ADR in the pound cat is 135 as you can see in the top left corner here. Today only went 117 so it has a bit of room to go. This is the ADR up here. It hasn't hit it yet and I just put my take profit on the other side just in case as sometimes the pound pair does it'll just spike up and I don't want to get out uh, uh, too quickly out of the trade. Here's my stop down here uh, default 20 pips. So this is just a waiting game and it may break the top and give me some more pips which is what I'm hoping for. And by the way, this is the uh, new, uh, another system that I am put together. I learned this many, many years ago, trading a channel. This is a channel, and this tells me the direction I should be going, either buying or selling. It's a very easy course, and I'm going to do approximately 16 videos on it. I just call it channel trading. and this is now included for anybody who buys the pip trigger as I'm watching this I can show you that this write up that you can see in this word document is also directly below this video and I'm now up to 252 training videos for the pip trigger and the latest one I'm, I'm doing teaching on is how to trade the channel I just call it the channel because it's just a channel and once you learn how easy it is to trade the channel, I find that it makes trading uh, quite easy. It's not difficult at all. I do have 10 versions of my pip trigger. In other words, at this price here, it works out to $25 a system, which is, the way I look at it, the best deal on the internet. Most people are charging this price for one system, and I'm you buy one and I give you ten. Your job as a trader is to get your hands on as much education as possible and this is exactly what I do. I give you a lot of training, a lot of education and this is what you need to become successful. Without it you will fail. So I've already done three videos on this, uh, how to trade the channel and basically I'm gonna do a grand total of 16 videos on it and I go in great detail giving a lot of tips and tricks exactly how to trade uh, this channel. And I'm now over 12 gigabytes of training just to let you know. I'm always adding more and more education. So getting back to the charts here, I'm over $2,000 right now approximately. It's going to fluctuate. If I remove the arrows, I made it l less cluttered only three moving averages and um, the MACD down here and the bulls and the bears and the HA bars uh, which are just my favorites it just brings clarity as I'm about to pull the trigger like right here when I pull the trigger this one right here was telling me to buy and again to buy it did go up and it did a pull back but I knew it wasn't going to break this bottom it just did a little bit of a cycle down, not very much. Ten, nine or ten pips. Have to keep an eye on this because I don't want to give too much back. I'm just going to keep an eye on the cycles. Might just come down to about here, hook around. Pound is starting to get weak and cat it, it's weaker than what it was. It was like the euro. It was higher up. You know, you just keep an eye on it, you know, it might just 
spike around and continue up which is what I'm hoping but I gotta pay attention this is the London close and it's close to 100 pips so party could be over the pound market is now closed the only thing pushing it is the CAD and I do a lot of uh, training a lot more than what you get here on the YouTube this is just to show you what I'm doing and then the training videos will help you to get there and I'll report back shortly either close the trade or just continue to manage it Forex Nelson is back I decided to close the trade very easy to see why the moving averages are crossing and the MACDs dropping and too much red down here at the bottom so I decided to close the trade I got in right here at this cursor and got out with 18 pips I'm happy with that and I as you can see looks like uh, I got out at the right time as opposed to you know the London close and looks like it's gonna do the the reversal now so you have to know how to trade and when to trade and which pairs to trade and how to trade within the blue boxes by the way I teach all of that uh, in the training videos so now I'm just gonna scan the market and see if I can find something for the London close according to my pip trigger rules and if not I'll just trade the Asian later on tonight and if you're interested in the pip trigger right below this video which is the same write up as right here in this word document you can call me directly and or email me and if you Skype me which is what I prefer I can give you lots of tips and tricks uh, that are free no obligation and see if the pip trigger is um, a fit for you so anyhow if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my youtube channel so until the next trade happy trading